Have you forgotten your Windows login password and you are worried about it? Then this video is just for you. In this video, you are going to learn how to bypass the Windows logon screen. If you have watched this video before then you know how to crack a Windows password using Rainbow Table. If you want to crack the login password then click the i button to watch the video now. In this experiment the tool I use here is CHNTPW. CHNTPW is a Kali Linux tool that can be used to edit the Windows registry and promote a user to administrator as well as several other useful options. Using CHNTPW is a great way to reset a Windows password or otherwise gain access to a Windows machine when you don't know what the password is. For this purpose, our requirement will be bootable Kali Live USB persistence. To build a Kali Live persistence you have to watch this video first click the i button to watch the video now. Before getting started make sure you have subscribed to my YouTube channel. If not yet did, click the subscribe button now and also press the bell icon to get notified when I upload a new video. This is my laptop installed with Windows 10 Pro and I forgot my login password. As you see I am not able to log in with any of my passwords. So now I want to reset the password. Let's do it. First of all, turn off your machine and boot with your Kali Live USB persistence. Don't know how? You have to watch the similar video to gain some knowledge on how to do it. Boot with Kali Live USB persistence. It will take time to boot. After all, you see the Kali Linux appears on the screen. Here on the Kali desktop screen, you see 53 gigabytes of volume, which stores all the data of your Windows operating system. It may be different from your side. Don't worry, just open that file. Actually, this is the C drive of your Windows OS. From here right click on your mouse and open the terminal here. Now change the directory to the configuration folder, where SAM files are stored. The Security Account Manager is a database that is present on computers running Windows operating systems that stores user accounts and security descriptors for users on the local computer. Let me check whether SAM exists or not on this directory. As you see these are the file that we need for our operation. Now run chntpw. Let me check with the help command. These are all useful commands that we use next. Now type chntpw i sam. I is used for an interactive menu system. Now type 1 to edit user data and passwords. Here, you see usernames with their information. Now copy the user number and paste it here. Now type 1 to clear or blank the user password. Now type 2 to unlock and enable the user account. Now type Q to quit editing user and go back to user select. Now type Q to quit. Now type Y to save the hive. Now close the terminal and power off the Kali Linux. Now unplug the pen drive and turn on your system. Now you see, I don't need any password to log in. If you have any doubts and queries, write me below in my comments section.